Hey guys, what is up? Welcome back to my channel. So, I'm currently in Utah, Salt Lake City. I am so excited. You guys are going to be following me around for the weekend. It is Saturday, it is two o'clock. Um, just landed and got my rental car. So I am on my way to my hotel and I actually have a friend here. Her name's Kylie and she and I are going to have lunch. I'm so excited. She's taking me to her favorite sushi spot. So that's what I'm on my way to go do right now. Well, I have to go check into my hotel and then I am gonna go meet her for lunch. So super excited to take you guys along with me. I have an extension class with Jay-Z style, so super hype. So yeah, if you guys are interested on following me around, then just go ahead and keep on watching. Hello, I'm back at the hotel. So I actually forgot to film myself like getting ready and the hotel room. So um, I just got back from lunch with my friend Kylie and we had the best like girls day, um, like girls lunch. So we went to this place called Tsunami. Um, it's a sushi place here in Lehigh, I believe is what this place is called. And we went to H&M and then we just like went to a couple other places. So I'm so excited to show you guys. I got the cutest stuff. I haven't been shopping, like bought myself some clothes in a really long time. So I, I it's the cutest stuff. But anyways, I wanted to show you guys the view from my hotel room. It is freaking beautiful, okay? Look at the mountains. I just like cannot get over how beautiful Utah is like if you live in Utah you are living it's just so beautiful Utah is just so beautiful but I wanted to show you guys my hotel room because it's super cutie I'm just here by myself so um, this is the bathroom right here hello hey um and then got a cutie little mirror I got these boots the other day from DSW and I am obsessed they're so cute and i got this sweater from marty and liz it's a small business in charlotte love so cute it has like little fuzzy fuzzy stars um and then yeah this is little hotel room so super cutie love it wanted to show you guys though want to show you guys my cute actually i'm gonna put you back on here I got it so blue. I'm just gonna sit on the floor real quick, but I got these two little scrunchies from H&M. So this is a really pretty like purpley color. It looks a little bit more blue, but it's very purple. Six bucks at H&M, so cute. And I got it because I got, I've been looking for shackets for so long. So you know, every girl needs a shacket right now. Um, so I got this one. And it is so freaking cute. I'm obsessed with it. Um, and I got this to match with it. So thought that'd be super cute potentially for the class tomorrow. I'm gonna try on all like my outfits because I just need like a cute outfit for tomorrow. Um, but I got a couple cute things. So I'm gonna decide what to wear. And then I got this shacket right here too. I just, I love it so much. I got this from H&M. Um, and this one was $50 and this one was $40. So super freaking cute, obsessed. And then I got this little like cute blazer from, um, what is this? Oh, J. Crew. The outlets are right across from me. So that makes it a little difficult. And I know the blazers don't look like super cute when I'm holding them up, but I'm actually going to put this pink one on strip down for a sec because I need to show you guys just how cute this thing is. I am obsessed. Like could not be more obsessed. Like look how cutie this little blazer is. And then you just got your little pockets and it just like fits so good. It's like so sexy but like professional. I love it. So I got it in pink and then I got it in black. Um, so yeah, I'm about to figure out what I wanna wear tomorrow so I can figure out what I wanna wear tonight. All right, so this is one of the shackets, which is so freaking cute. I am obsessed. It's just like super oversized. Love it, especially with the chunky boot. 
I don't think I'm gonna wear this one tomorrow um because I like the other one better I feel like this one's like a little bit too big in a sense this is like a size small but it's like super oversized whereas the purple one kind of fits a little bit better hmm. so this is the other one and this is literally my favorite jacket ever shacket jacket obsessed especially once again with a chunky boot such a vibe and this so this is actually what i got the blazer for is because i feel like with mom jeans blazers look so freaking cute so just put these on paired it with the boot love i am obsessed i feel like this might be my outfit for class tomorrow i feel like that's a really cute outfit for this lawn you guys can't see me, but I am on my way to, <laughs> to go meet Stu and Katie, and I'm so excited. I'm going to go have dinner with them, um, and I think we're going to a place called Los Hermanos, I'm pretty sure. Um, a Mexican restaurant, of course. Oh, I'm so sad you had a drink. You should cheers the bowl. I know, cheers the bowl. <laughs> All right, one, two, three. So All right, so I just got done with dinner and <laughs> we had quite possibly like the worst dining experience at that hotel. Um, it's called Los Hermanos and it was horrible. Like we all ordered those margaritas that you guys saw and they were virgin and we had no idea. We were like, oh my God, drinks like so cute, you know, it's such a vibe, but they were virgin did not know that they had like a full drink menu and they were like daiquiris and all this stuff all virgin one sec anyways as you guys saw i am at the mcdonald's drive through i <laughs> am really hungry we like touched two bites of our meal um the service was just like awful the server had no idea what she was doing um Granted, it was like, I think her second or third day. So we weren't like trying to be like a pain or anything like that. It's just like the drinks were obviously not what we expected them to be. And nobody let us know that they were virgin. I feel like you should tell that to someone. Like, I feel like that should be something that you say um, when they order them. But anyways, and then our food was like cold and then it didn't have all the things that was supposed to be on it. And the tacos were just like, it was just bad. So anyways, um, we all just ended up deciding to go home and now I am picking up my food, but now I'm picking up my food. I'm sorry for like the horrible lighting. Obviously it's nighttime and I'm in a drive through Um, but yeah, I'm picking up my McDonald's, picking up my little McDonald's meal. I'm excited. I haven't had McDonald's in a very, very long time. Um, but yeah, so I guess I'll see you guys in the morning or something. Good morning, you guys. I just woke up a little bit ago and I am currently just touching up some curls in my hair. It is so pretty outside my window. I'm about to show you guys the sunrise. Um, and then I'm gonna go downstairs and get myself some breakfast and um, start getting my makeup ready. When I go downstairs, I obviously have to wear a mask, so I don't wanna be like mid makeup and put on a mask, so. I'll be back to show you guys. All right, I got myself some breakfast. They don't really have that many options, but it's totally fine. I might just stop on my way in because it's only 7.30 and the class doesn't start till 10. So I got Fruit Loops and I got some cereal, I mean some milk to put in my cereal. I've got an orange and then they actually did have this little thing of hot food. So it's just like eggs, sausage, and some potatoes. Um, and I got some water, so. That is what I'm drinking and eating, and I'm going to call Christian so I can talk to him for a little bit before I start getting ready.
I'm about to put on, so I'm about to put on my lashes, which are these ones right here. And I wanted to tell you about them because every time I wear these, I don't know why this lighting is being so weird, but every time I wear these, I get so many questions and they're the perfect kind of like lash extension look with out the lash extensions just um, a lash so this is the kiss lashes in jubilee is the style i just like cut off like it was like a whole big thing like a whole pack um but i just cut off the pack so i could travel with it super easy um this is what i can't look at the camera but this is what my makeup is looking like so far i used my estee lauder double wear foundation haven't worn it in such a long time but it's such a tried and true Alrighty, so this is the finished makeup look. Love these lashes. They are literally my favorite. And if you guys are wondering what, and if you guys are wondering what lip combo I did, it is the LA Girl um, Nonstop Nude. Is it Nonstop Nude? Yes, Nonstop Nude Lip Liner, and then a Child Star by Too Faced. This is the Ash and J hat from Jay-Z Styles. And then this is a little blazer that I got yesterday from J. Crew, which I think is just so cute. I was going to wear the black one, but I decided on this one instead. And then just have a little black tank from Target. My Gucci belt, these jeans. I think these are one little teaspoon or a little teaspoon or something like that. And then DSW booties. Love these so much. So yeah, that is my outfit for the day. So hey, Gara. Hello, how's it going? Stew. Stew. Hey guys, I took the worst dinner last night of her life. <laughs> I, saw, I talked doing. about it. I literally talked about it on my channel. Yeah, the best virgin murder you tacos with no toppings. I literally <laughs> showed my order at McDonald's. <laughs> <laughs> was I was like, I just got back to my hotel and I did want to show you guys what I got from Jay-Z Styles because I got a couple of things um, from like the retail but I have a client who's actually already interested in extensions and I got her she has like super dark hair but we did like a combo of like highlights and lowlights on her but I toned her with like a 7-8 on her highlights so I got this color, which is the Kendra, um, and it just has, like, you can't really tell with the lighting, but it has a highlight, low light, and then this is just a solid brown, which is the Bentley, so I'm going to mix both of them, and I am so excited for that, but, um, yeah, I wanted to show you guys those two things that I got. I got some threading and some beads, because I already have the lighter beads and the lighter thread, and then I also got a swatch ring with all the different swatches of shades that Jay-Z Styles has. And then I also got these three um, like practice hair. So this is the hand tied weft, this is the cozy weft, and this is the machine weft. So I am using these to practice, of course, on my mannequin when I get home. Uh, super excited to just kind of practice and get used to everything. There's so much information that I learned in today's class. It was honestly such an amazing class and I cannot wait to get home and just like get my hands in some extensions. Like I'm just, 
I, I don't know. I just, I love this industry so much and it's so fun to learn new methods and new techniques and things like that. I'm about to go in the shower and go to bed and just end today's vlog. But before I ended, I just wanted to say how thankful I am to be able to have come out to Utah and just train with some of the best people in the industry, in my opinion. Um, Jay-Z Styles, Jesse and Stu Styles, and just Katie and everybody that is involved with the whole Jay-Z Styles team is just just like unbelievably um, they're just so talented and they're so knowledgeable and everything and the way that they teach and everything is just so awesome and their whole like business with the whole like family model and everything is just so so amazing to me and I just look up to Jesse and everything that she's created and so I was just really really excited and so thankful to have come out today and um, just this whole weekend and spent some time with them and just seen everything that they had to offer in the salon um, and just extensions and stuff and um, I just I'm so thankful for this industry and just to be able to be a part of an industry where you're just constantly learning and growing and you're actually like excited to learn and grow and everything so um, yeah I just wanted to say that if you guys have ever you know wanted to learn hair extensions or you know if you're interested on taking any courses or something just do it for yourself you guys you really 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 owe it to yourself to just go ahead and invest in education and your craft I mean our clients pay us so much money and you really want to just give them the best possible service um, that you can and just give them the latest and the greatest um, techniques and stuff so if you guys have ever considered taking the Jay-Z Styles extension course, I highly, highly recommend it. You guys, they, seriously, I, I was on Stu's team today and he was like right behind me making sure I was doing everything right and when I was doing something wrong, um, he went ahead and like corrected how I was doing it and showed me exactly the right way how to do it. So it was like step by step. It was so personable um, and you just really got that one-on-one -on -one time with an educator and I just I highly recommend could not recommend it anymore so if you guys have ever been interested I just wanted to give my honest opinion on that I'm so happy that I invested in this course and just this whole trip in this weekend getaway I feel like I just really needed it to refresh myself so yeah with that being said I will go ahead and close out today's vlog but I hope you guys enjoyed following me around for the weekend and thank you so much for tuning into my channel hopefully you guys hit the subscribe button while you were watching and I hope to see you all in my next video bye guys